Fads, or fish aggregating devices, when used with purse seine nets, have disastrous impacts on the ocean's tuna stocks, other marine life, and put the Pacific region's food security and economic prosperity at risk. But visionary tuna industry leaders are moving away from fads and instead setting nets on free swimming schools of tuna like it used to be done. One such ship is Frabelle owned Purple Lilac 888, seen here in the Pacific Ocean. It is one of 16 Frabelle vessels now equipped to fish without fads. To encourage this move, the crew receives a 35% increase in their income when they catch free swimming tuna as opposed to catching tuna on fads. Using a combination of modern technology and ancient methods, the ship's crew and captain locate a school of tuna. They approach the fish and circle them with a giant purse seine net. The die and speedboats serve to confuse the fish and prevent them from escaping. The net is drawn closed and the fish are trapped. The net is hauled on board and eventually the fish are scooped from the net into the hold. Although some bycatch is present, the amount is far smaller than with purse seine fat fishing, which increases the catch of sharks and juvenile big eye and yellowfin tuna to unsustainable levels. Purse seine fishing on free swimming tuna results in larger tuna being caught that can be sold at a higher price to processors. Uh, there are simply too many fishing vessels uh, operating and catching fish in the Pacific Ocean as, at this point in time. And uh, their heavy reliance on fads and use of small mesh nets uh, only intensifies the overfishing uh, that is happening. As consumers around the world demand less wasteful and more sustainable fishing methods, forward-thinking companies are moving away from fad fishing and embracing solutions such as pole and line, catching tuna one by one and with even less bycatch, and fad-free fishing. The answers are out there, and the sustainable tuna fishing sector is growing and can continue. The industry should actually really work together from the fishermen to the packers to the fish brokers and to the retailers and to uh, non-governmental organizations such as Greenpeace. Uh, we have to all work in hand, hand in hand so that uh, we can see a, a better future for all of us. Demand your retailers and tuna brands switch to more sustainably caught pole and line and fat-free purse sane caught tuna.